Yeah, I'm also on each other I know it has been some time since I made a video. Uh, things aren't doing so well at the moment, so, you know, I'm just keeping myself away from everything. Mm, yes. Making a video gonna change my mood because to me it is like going out there. So let's go. I thought to make a has been ages. So I wanted to make a fashion related video and I'm gonna change my hair because it has been some time. As you can see I have shaved it um, as I turned it to because I have forgotten. Um, so yeah. Recently this has been my favorite haircut. A mohawk. So I would shave um, the sides all the way here. Now I could keep my hair short here but longer from here. And yes, you see this blonde part. I bleached it because I thought, you know, my plan was to make it white. You know, and um, you know, from my experience, making my hair white takes a long, a long, long time, and it really damaged my hair. So I made this, and I waited for it to, you know, waited for my hair to settle until I could bleach it again but I've forgotten about it, it's a long process and I was bored so I forgot it like this and today I thought I'm gonna dye it black again back to black because I have ordered this, um, you know, hair wax or hair mud there is this one I bought the white one so it really keeps me away from bleaching my hair anymore and I tried it and I fell in love with it it is like wax so it is sticky but it really does the job for me I like it so yeah I'm gonna turn my hair black finally and I'm gonna just use this from now on if I wanted my hair to go white just I'll, I'll show you how it works really so first of all let's dye my hair let's kill it black it appears that I don't have gloves anymore yeah. Don't copy me, I'm just, I do things crazily. So I'm gonna use my hand to, let me take my glasses off, to dye my hair. It's only this part, but actually I remember that when I dye my whole, like my hair is black, but when I dye it more black, it becomes very like nicely, you know, thick and black, which I like. So I don't have gloves. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> Don't copy me. Do I even have some color in it? Do not do this at home. That's it. This is basically it. This is the part I wanted to dye. But you see how very nicely black it is? So when I put it actually in my hole, like everywhere, which I don't like to do because it gets damaged for no good reason, but it really get, makes it really, you know, very nicely black, which I really love. Like, look at this, it's really really thickly black and I love this the color is so dense my hand is so black too <laughs> my hand is so black if I were a painter catch your own compass funny I already feel like I'm cheered up just by making this video Mm, very interesting how YouTube really plays with my mood. If I upload a video, I always feel better. I guess because it was YouTube that really changed my life. So it really stuck with me, has become my diary basically to me. My YouTube is like my diary, that's why I basically share everything with you people. Look how beautiful it is, like nicely dark. Even my tattoos look cool here, I don't know if you can see. Okay, I'm gonna leave it to settle. And then I'm gonna wash it. And then I'm gonna show you how I use the Mofa junk and just turn my hair. Let's hope that it's gonna go away. I feel like a gorilla. It's actually nice, I can do some art with it. Well, I shower at least twice a day, so this should be gone soon, but better than nothing. <laughs> I love how it looks like from here. Just... Never mind, I'll see you soon. I washed my hair and dried it. There's still kind of color in here, but it doesn't matter as long as it's covered. 
Uh, do you see this? Can you see this? It's a bit kind of greenish. Well, if you can't see it, that's good. <laughs> Anyways. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna style my hair. What I use is this guy. It's an old uh, oil hair tonic from Vaseline. It's really old and you can see by the logo how the logo looks like. The reason I use this is because I remember my father used to use this one. Um, and I used to really admire him because I thought he looked really elegant. And when you see when I put it my hair it makes it really buff, makes it really smooth and really shiny. So if you're the type like me who takes showers a lot or like damage your hair, if your hair was dry basically, this guy here makes it makes it really like gives it oils because you know when your hair is dry it likes oils. And this guy here is is very hydrated. Could you see the difference now? <sighs> yeah, it makes it really shiny. And yeah, really makes it really good. Yeah, what I do is I focus on the edges, that's why I do this. Because you know, the edges are like the worst parts uh, that get really damaged easily. Alright, now that I'm done, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this guy, I don't know what you call it. I'm gonna I'm gonna brush my hair back. This is not really the only style I do, but I just thought to make this one for this video. If you guys really enjoy this, tell me to do more fashion or hairstyle videos. Yeah, so what I do is brush it and then I would use the side to smoothen it. If you can see so it. And then what I do is I just run my fingers through to make it, I don't know what you call it, but kind of bumpy from here. So yeah, it looks not so sticky, not so sticky to your head, just a bit bumpy. That's what I am looking for. Let's put those back. Yeah, and what you can do is, you know, you can put it on the side if you wanted to. You can make your bangs fall to the side if you wanted to. Put the other side if you wanted to. What I do sometimes is just make it look like, wait, I don't know what you call it. But make it fall to the sides so it would look like something. Yeah, it would look like, like this. Anyways, let's use the Mafajang I told you about. There's this guy here, and what I, I actually use it only once, so I'm not really sure if it's maybe it was time I'm gonna use it better. But right now, what I do is I just take a little bit because if you well, if you want the color to appear more, you take you take more uh, amount. But I don't want more. I don't want like too much. So what I do is I just. I put it between my fingers and then I'm gonna run run it through my hair so it gives it this white look. If you want more I can just like put more white in here if I want it to. So if I want it more I can just swipe I need to look at myself in the mirror. So yeah if you, you see, if you put more, if the amount was thicker in your fingers, the thing I love to do is just run it through because it kind of makes it look also kind of naturally shiny at times, especially if it was really thin, the layer was really thin that you're putting on your hair just makes it look shiny because you know it is white it's like the same as painting you would use white to you know make something look shiny or whatever yeah, that's basically it that's how i use the mofa junk and you can just simply play with it 
um, a very interesting maneuver I do to my hair to make it look wavy. I would take a part and I would curl it with my finger. So if I'm gonna just do this gently, so I don't wanna you know, pick your hair, just do it gently. look really nicely curved. That's it for the today's video. This is the final look. And it doesn't have to stick like this. You can just play with it throughout the day. It doesn't matter. But gently you don't wanna you don't wanna you know hurt your delicate hair. Okay never mind get out of here. I'm really sorry I took too long. Like I'm really I have the cosplay video I haven't uploaded yet. I have too many ideas to upload. I have too many things to do. But I don't know, there's just no motivation. And then when I did this video my motivation is back, so that's good. Alright, it's time for me to disappear. So 